What's up, Longhorn fans? Once again, this is Pelaya. Week one is in the books. Texas beat Wyoming 37-17. David Ash put up some pretty decent numbers. I mean, 20 out of 27, that's over 70%. 150 plus yards and a touchdown. Jackson Shipley threw his first career uh, incompletion. Malcolm Brown and Joe Bergeron both would not be denied, both rushing for over 100 yards apiece. One touchdown for Malcolm Brown, two touchdowns for Joe Bergeron, a touchdown for DJ Monroe, which all three of those guys were averaging, think about like seven yards per carry, which was pretty good for the rushing attack. Uh, on the defensive side of things, Kenny Vaccaro and Carrington Bindham both got an interception apiece. I mean, we got beat a couple times in the secondary. I don't know what happened. There was one play where uh, I think it was the first touchdown that Wyoming scored. Brett Smith threw it to one of his receivers. We had three Longhorns surrounding the guy. He somehow got out of that tackle and went by 80 yards plus to go score. That was uh, unacceptable, but if offense can keep giving us them yards running and ball control, no interceptions, if we can avoid turnovers all season, we'll be a pretty good team. Right now, I feel like Texas is kind of flying under the radar. Check back with me later on in the week. I'm about to put another video on New Mexico. I feel like these running backs are really gonna go ham on New Mexico. Definitely expect to see Case McCoy. We, didn't, we never got to see him on Saturday against Wyoming, but I would expect to see him against New Mexico. Hook'em horns, see y'all later in the week.